equals a minus b. Notice the minus sign and the minus sign. And then we have a squared plus a times b plus b squared. If only I knew the a and the b, all I would need to do is substitute. Sort of like the quadratic formula. You kind of want to identify the A and the B, and then it makes sense when we substitute everything in. Where did that A, B come from? This is the formula that you saw on the previous page. It's also up here on the board, so you don't have to flip back and forth. So we have our A value. Since this is A cubed, our A value is just X. The cube root of X cubed is just X. And then our B value is the cube root of 1 which is 1. So we can plug that in. And we get x minus 1 times a squared, so x squared plus x times 1, or 1x, or just x. And then b squared. 1 squared is We set that equal to zero. Right away you go, oh, there's the one. We already knew about that guy. So here's, we already know one of our solutions is one. The other solution, so x minus one equals zero, gives us a solution of one. And then we have to do x squared plus x plus one equals zero. That's that second part, or second factor. We're going to need to use the quadratic formula. putting it all together here. The fun part about this one is A is 1, B is 1, and C is 1. <laughs> look back on the back wall just as a refresher. If you look at the sign with the dragon with the thought cloud, it's nice and bold. You can see it clearly. The quadratic formula, there it is. We're going to plug everything in. So x equals negative 1 plus or minus the square root of b squared. They're all 1, so they're going to makes it easier and more confusing at the same time. b squared minus 4 times a times c all over 2a. You need to play that song again. That was great. So we have negative 1 plus or minus the square root. Remember, we find the value of the discriminant. 1 minus 4 is negative 3. Over 2. You can flip to the back. So I have a negative under a square root. We all know what that means. Comes out as an i. So we have negative 1 plus or minus i radical 3 over 2. that say 2 minus 4? This is 1 squared. Oh, okay. So there's our second and third solutions, right? The plus would be our second solution, and the minus would be our third solution. So we have 1, 2, 3 solutions, which matches our degree. So those are all our solutions. There's no 